This tutorial will explain how easy it is to backup and restore your application in Warp Engineering Studio. A restore point is a saved snapshot of your Warp project. By creating a restore point, you save all hardware and software configurations, enabling you to restore the project and your data. Establishing a restore point creates a backup copy of all data at that particular moment. This tutorial uses the hardware configuration built in the previous tutorial. The generate function in Warp always creates an automatic restore point. All restore points are found in the restore points window. You can delete existing restore points by clicking on the delete button. It's also possible to create your own restore point. Simply click on the create new button. Enter a name and click OK. Adding a comment makes it easier to remember which changes were made for each version. We will now make changes in the project and create a new restore point. The existing frequency inverter is selected and copy pasted into the workspace. We rename the new object to BFI3 and connect it to the EtherCAT network. A new restore point is added by clicking on the Create New button. The name is changed to Restore Point 2. We'll add a comment to remind us that this version contains an additional frequency inverter. We can now click on the Restore button to switch back to the previous version of the project. Select Yes to confirm that you want to proceed to restore the project. Select the Restore Point 2 and click on the Restore button to open the latest version of the project again. To sum up, Restore Points provide a powerful function, making it easier for the user to back up and restore different states of a complete WARP project. We call it Fast Forward Engineering. Download Warp from a smart store and start to work smarter.